The metric system was born in France in the 1790s. They devised the system and it quickly spread through Europe. Conversely, the imperial system, which we use today here in the U.S., came about in a different way. While the ancient Egyptians were trying to build their pyramids, they looked down at their hands and feet and had a revolution. Somewhat. But this is problematic. Their system was based on human quantities, which changed from human to human. This appendage-based system made its way to the U.S. We kept some of the names and gave them fixed numbers. In 1786, Thomas Jefferson tried implementing the metric system, but Congress voted it down due to lack of support. So close, America. As of right now, the United States, Liberia, and my Myanmar are the only countries still hanging on to the imperial system. 50% of the U.S. already uses the metric system because it's a universal language for science and medicine. Even in schools, students learn both systems. Additionally, in 1992, Congress updated the Fair Packaging and Labeling Act, which made most consumer products in the country labeled with both metric and imperial. Changing to the metric system would save a lot of time and energy because the U.S. will no longer have to convert between systems when trading internationally. By using multiples of 10 and units with roots following a decimal pattern, it makes it easy to convert and visualize in your head. And there are still people who are against the metric system. The two main reasons why they are against the metric system is that it is a lot of work to switch and they don't like the idea that America is changing just to conform to the rest of the world. But in reality, the metric system will actually save our country money because we will no longer have to convert. Maybe the reason the rest of the world is using the metric system is because it actually works. Not doing something just to be unique is going to hurt the United States in the end. Do you still want to use the imperial system? Probably not. We need to switch to metric because 50% of our country is already using metric. Both systems is a waste of time, is more logical, and will make things easier and simpler. We will have to call interworms centerworms, but that is a sacrifice we and they are willing to make.